Hello, it's Alan here from EXA Foundation. This video is to explain the challenge that we have designed for you. So, we know from climate scientists that the very future of our planet is at stake. As world leaders and politicians, they gather together, they're discussing policies towards achieving net zero emissions. And at the same time, groups of climate protesters, well, they're taking the law into their own hands. They've been inspired by activists like Greta Thunberg, Extinction Rebellion and Insulate Britain. So what do we do? Well, we can sit back, we can relax and we can wait for our government politicians to change the laws so that we have to do things. Or we could just decide ourselves that we're going to take steps in our lives to reduce our carbon emissions. We could do that from today. So we've set a challenge for you today. We want you in your groups to design and develop a prototype for a project that encourages people, people that you know, your friends, your family, to take small steps in the right direction to live in a more sustainable manner every day. Now, we want you to make use of the algorithmic potential, the physical computing capabilities of the microbit. Yeah, this thing. <laughs> and we want you to find a way to use it so that it encourages people to think, to change their behaviour and help reduce their consumption. Now, the microbit, it's a very small or compact computer and it can be programmed to sense environmental changes and it has a variety of onboard sensors. Now, what we can do is we can use it to track and report changes in environment and then respond in different ways. Now, the microbits that you're going to be using today, are, they're a version one. They've got the capability to sense touch, movement, temperature, light and compass direction. And they can output light symbols and text via the onboard LED matrix. They can also emit sound, but it's a complicated arrangement where you need wires and a speaker or headphones. But they can also use radio to broadcast messages to other microbits. Now you're going to be set a deadline today, at which point you'll be asked to demonstrate your prototype to a small group of other students and staff. You might build a physical model of a prototype, but it's largely going to use software. And the key thing is all about how you're using the microbit to get people to think, to change, and then encourage them or reward them in some way, whether it's tracking or counting these small changes that they're going to make towards reducing their carbon emissions. So that's it, really. It's over to you now. There will be some instructions and lots of things available to you that you can go and use. Oops. Good luck. Your planet depends upon what you do today and from this day forward. Hmm.